Yes, welcome to Kosovo here on this Austrian days and it's absolutely fantastic. We are working together for Kosovo and Austria to be united in NATO, in the Euro and in the European Union together with our friends, partners, allies of uh, Bosnia and of um, Ukraine. And of course, there is no doubt that Serbia must be isolated and must be punished and confronted for her crimes in the past and for uh, her lack uh, of regret and repentance. And so we need to work together to achieve that in a coalition between Ukraine and Bosnia and of course Austria and the European Union. This will be my main message. Additionally, I remind everybody Austria is a friendly country since 1912, having recognized Albania and my apologies that we didn't recognize Kosovo as part of Albania back then. History is like it is, we cannot change it, but we can overcome the past crimes by accounting for it regretting them and being ready for a common future in NATO, EU and the Euro and that what we all should achieve. The history of division and of uh, Russian interference and war is terrible and we need to overcome these tragic parts of our history by being united in Europe. What we need of course is that the Skanderbeg helmet is returning uh, to Albania and to Kosovo on a permanent basis and of course uh, we need also to achieve um, joint projects uh, like of course infrastructure connecting Austria and Kosovo and of course we need uh, energy investment into the Kosovo sector for being energy independent from Serbia. This is very very important and we need to achieve that in the coming weeks, months and days uh, ahead of this decisive moment when Kosovo gets a NATO membership, EU candidate status and Kosovo should be in the European Union 2029 and Serbia must be isolated. Additionally, we need uh, to make sure that we have um, the, um, the Austrian labor market to be opened. That's very important. And also that we have um, a Kosovo History Museum in Austria as well uh, to uh, understand our friendship and our cooperation and our mutual uh, historic roots and our common future in the European Union and in NATO. And that would be about my agenda in the coming days. Thanks a lot and more to come from Pax Europeana here during my Kosovo days. Bye.